Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to what could be the final installment of Mass Effect 3. We are just about to assault the elusive man's base. He's been getting up to some dirty dealings. And we've got to go and put a stop to Cerberus once and for all. Before, you know, they end the galaxy along with the Reapers, I guess. Anyway, let's get to it. We're hopping in. Yeah, we won't bother reading any of that. Let's go. Shepard, the intel you sent looks good. The fleets are ready to go. But? Once we're committed against Cerberus, it won't be long before the Reapers take notice. And the Crucible? Ready. Except for the Catalyst. But there's no way to hide the ships we'll be sending at Cerberus. Once we attack, the Crucible won't stay safe for long. For all intents and purposes, an assault on Cerberus will be the first stage of our attack on Earth. Oh, oh, good stuff. What happens if Cerberus doesn't have the intel we need? Or they stop us from getting it? Then we lead the fleets to Earth and we take our chances. But your intel points to Cerberus and the elusive man holding the information we're looking for. And... We have the element of surprise. Cerberus won't know what hit him. I want to make sure we're no. ready before we commit. Understood. The fleets are ready when you are. F. I meant to... I didn't... Oh. Nine! God. Damn it. Right, bear with me a second, folks, because I... I'm a numpty. Oh, really? Come on, just let me through the damn screen. Oh, my God, please. Command, are you ready to send the fleets against the Cerberus stronghold? Yes, for God's sake. The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're going to end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized. It's oh, hello. It's going to take a few more hours for the fleets to mobilize. I hate the waiting. I've been trying to find ways to pass the time. Come up with anything good? I thought maybe you could use some company tonight. Will you stay here with me? Until the call comes? as long as you want. Oh, it's that dream sequence again. Shepherd. Come here, you little brat. Shepard. Shepard. Oh, could this be the whispers of those that have... That won't happen. Go get him, Commander. I'll see you all when you get back. I think those are the whispers of those that have passed. adapted. No more negative reaction to you anymore. That's how we survive. Is it how we survive? Adapting? To a cold or interspecies contact? Yes. To the Reapers? No. You're doing the right thing. You've assembled the largest military force in history. Nobody could have done more. 
We've lost so much already. Sometimes I... You don't know if what'll be left was worth the fight. I know. And when I feel that way, I reach for you. Thanks. Whenever you need me. To be fair, the state of the whole galaxy was quite the burden for one man's shoulders. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Fifth Fleet, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Grab your gear. Oh, it's happening. So, we've got Edie with us, regardless. And we'll take her in full battle rattle. Uh, who else are we going to take with us? I think... Oh, I don't know. Might have to be Garrus, actually. Man, I'll tell you, Garrus... He's gone with me on nearly every mission, not going to lie. But, there's a reason. He's freaking awesome! Right. Confirm. Nothing I can do there, or there, or there. Let's go. Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? Hey, I got us to Ilos. I can do this. That might be a bumpy ride, though. Do what you can. Shepard, I am ready. Wait, wh what? Are you crazy? You can't go to Cerberus headquarters. They could have a virus or a kill switch or... I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shuttle, Edie. Fifth Fleet's cut through their line. They're regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. I know it hurts. Not being able to go with her. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. Thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> hey, Shepard. Keep her safe. Same to you. Yo. Taking it to the man. That's how you deal with pesky guards. You throw a shadow at him. Everything okay, Cortez? I'm fine. We got repairs to make here. Give Cerberus help. All right. Let's see how well we do. He went down off the sack, Taters. Oh. They have an atlas. Okay, they've also got nemeses. Oh, I really should actually use my freaking drones. Damn snipers. Oh, they're taking down ED too. Wait a second. 
let's turn the armor on. Armor piercing round, shall we? Ow. Ugh. Oof. Still a nemesis here. Ah. Security breach in Hangar 16. Initiating Achilles protocol. Shepard, Cerberus intends to vent the hangar bay. Oh. Can you stop? I need an active console. Try the upper level. We better find an active console. We better try the upper level. Console and stop servers from venting the hangar. Edie, I've got a console. Go! Oof. Hangar vent procedure. Disabled. Can you open the hangar? No. However, I can access their fighter launch controls. I think we're about to open the door the hard way. Shepard, servers is aware that the venting attempt failed. Reinforcements are inbound. Ow! Shoot me in the back! That hit a wall. That didn't. What have we got around here? Another Cerberus team is inbound. Guess they figured out what we're doing. They're not stopping us now. Oh, you're a cheeky toad. Ow. Yeah. That's what happens when you don't have adequate cover, bitch. Right. We've got an ear then. I really don't think it's. Uh, oh, rotation controls. Oh, hello. Medical station? Don't mind if I do. Let's top off. Get some medi gel. Overriding safeties. The fighter should now launch toward the hangar door. Perfect. Let's get down there. Oh, I wonder if we're going to have any more uh, issues. Oh, hello. What have we got here? An active PDA. 5,000 credits. Don't know what I can even intend to use those for now. Alright, how do I launch this bird? On. Escape hangar. Vague much. Ah. Launching fighter. <laughs> Impressive. The central lab was located behind this hangar. I suggest we follow the fighter's path. Noted. Let's move.
Well, I'm going to stop you. Bit of the frost, little bit of the fire. That was the last Cerberus team in this area. We've broken their front rank. Now we can cause some real damage. Indeed, we can. Can we save? We can. Good stuff. Let's roll. M37 Falcon. That will continue. I think we missed out on a bit of conversation there. Edie, can you get past? One moment. Cerberus has updated their encryption. There may be a slight delay as I bypass security. How's Cerberus reacting to us breaching the door? They are sealing off as much of the base as they can. Most obvious routes to the central lab are blocked. Other areas are being fortified. Heavy troopers will attempt to delay us while engineers set up turrets. Any more surprises like venting the hangar? No. I am aware of this facility's safeguards and can counteract them. Cerberus can merely slow us down. And if I hadn't brought you along? Cerberus would have vented the hangar. Thanks for coming. I am pleased to assist. <laughs> We must proceed through a sub-level to avoid Cerberus containment measures. Where do you think we'll find the Prothean VI? A central lab at the heart of this facility. It is the most secure area. Following the destruction left by the fighter will offer the most direct route. Here we go! Right. Down the ladder. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Get up from that position, will you, mate? Right, what have we got here then? Oh, for goodness sake, just get beyond cover, Shepard, will you? Well, my drone certainly found something to zap. Wait. Tell you what, man. Overload versus organics when you get that uh, uh, perk for it is pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. stop us. Engineers are currently preparing an organized defense ahead. They can waste that many troops? Yes. Cerberus employs Reaper augmentation on captured civilians to create functional shock troops quickly. Just like the Reapers did with the Collectors, turning victims into shock troops. Yes. Good grief. We will be through momentarily. Shepard, that console has not been fully scrubbed. 
It contains data you may find interesting. What am I looking at? Project Lazarus, your reconstruction. It can't be done. It's not a matter of resources. It's always a matter of resources. We're not losing Shepard. Sir, Shepard is clinically brain dead. After that much trauma, that long with no oxygen, we cannot overcome nature. Operative Lawson disagrees. She is now in charge of Project Lazarus. I didn't realize it was that bad. Pretty stark. You okay? I'm still me. I doubt I'd have been able to turn against Cerberus otherwise. I don't remember anything. Maybe they really just fixed me, or... Maybe I'm just a high-tech VI that thinks it's Commander Shepard. But I don't know, I... Be surprising if it didn't mess you up a little. Tissue regeneration is proceeding. The helmet kept the brain intact for whatever good that will do. Lawson will find a way. Sir, you realize that Shepard is a veteran of a coup's? A Cerberus operation wiped out his entire squad. Shepard's a soldier. He knows the Reapers are the real threat. He'll work with us. He really had you boxed in. Every instinct I had told me not to trust Cerberus. But I needed their help. So I played along. You did what you had to, Shepard. And I was there with you. Project Lazarus is reporting neurological activity. They're requesting more funding. Granted. Get me our potential recruits file. Shepard will be up soon. We need a crew. Our existing forces should be more than sufficient. No. We need sympathetic faces. I need Shepard invested. Tap Kelly Chambers and recruit Donnelly. I imagine Miss Daniels will follow. We want some old friends as well. Contact Dr. Chakwas and send me the psych profile on Shepard's pilot along with a bottle of 47 Thessia Red. Sneaky little bastard. Use them to keep you from seeing the real Cerberus. I think that was the last, uh, yeah, that was the last entry. How's that door coming, Edie? We are clear to proceed. Incursion team, what's your status? We've cleared the hangar and are inside the base. Good work. Do you need support? Negative. Keep the heat on. We'll find what we need. As we go through a burning fricking hole. Your turrets are belong to me. <laughs> Engineers, man, pretty dirty, not gonna lie. If we can deploy that turret to help us. Give me that. Oh, well done, Garrus. Him taken care of. Who's next? Shepard, they are attempting to flank us. Yeah, that ain't gonna work.
that they are. And this time I'm going to do a little better. Oh. Uh, oh. Right, that gets rid of that bloody thing. Took a couple of attempts, but uh, nothing too bad, nothing too bad. Going up. I will bypass the lock. If you are interested, the console nearby is still functional. Console nearby. Any of these? Ah. on Luna? Yes. Guess we didn't exactly get off on the right foot. It was difficult. Gaining awareness while under attack was confusing. I am pleased that my relationship with organics has become more cooperative. Well, there's a throwback. Our sims indicate that the enhanced defense intelligence gives the highest combat improvement on frigates. Anything heavier, and the ships react too slowly to benefit from Edie's advice. Edie? Oh, that's, uh, it, well, the boys in the lab came up with a name for her. For it. Good work. I'll take your recommendations on planned installation. Sir, she... It can be very persuasive. If it were to turn a crewman, convince them to disable the shackles, well... It's a cyber warfare suite, Doctor. Nothing more. Oh. I'll go back to that one. What about the backups? I'm sorry, sir. None of Normandy's surveillance feeds have been responding since Shepard went rogue. I want it back. Retried the remote lockdown protocols. After our last attempt, Edie flooded our server with seven zettabytes of explicit images. I think she was making a joke. It doesn't make jokes, Doctor. Allocate a team for a new project. Codename Eva. This time we'll ensure it stays loyal. Okay. You never told me about Cerberus trying to shut down the Normandy. You had more pressing issues. The situation was under control. Seven Zeta bytes? Most of it was Jeff's. That was. A joke. 
I know. And thank you. <laughs> right, let's go back to this one. Uh, I can skip the dialogue, I think. Arson? Anything heavier? I'm with Edie? No, that's uh, for it. Sir, she... It's a sub... Okay. Shows what he knew. It is unlikely that anyone without Jeff's extreme emotional attachment to his ship would have been willing to unshackle me. I don't know. With that voice? No. <laughs> Okay, the conversation was a little bit broken up there in dialogue, but eh, we got there in the end. Another security lock. I can bypass it. Incursion team, are you still with us? We're limiting fire as best we can. Admiral, we're in deep and the Prothean BI will be in the safest part of the station. Don't hold back. This isn't a coup, Shepard. I want everyone to come out of this one alive. I'll be fine. Just take Cerberus down. Please. Understood, Commander. All ships, you're free to fire. We're gonna nuke the shit out of Cerberus. Oh! Oh well, I won't look over there then. Looks like the human proto reaper we killed. Oh crap. Left of it. I'm surprised Cerberus recovered that much from the base. All those colonists kidnapped, processed into that, and Cerberus hangs it up like a trophy. The elusive man convinced me to work with him to save the colonies. But he never really cared, did he? I think he did. He just cares more about studying it. The dead are only a statistic now. Somehow, that seems even worse. Cerberus is actively using the surviving pieces. The central core, analogous to the heart, is largely intact. I believe Cerberus is using it for a power source. Oh boy. That damn thing. I hope I ain't gotta fight it again. That was a horrible boss fight. Now well, I can save. More Cerberus forces on route. Guess we're getting close. Cerberus phantoms incoming! Oh shit! Oh god! I was not prepared! Let's try this again. Oh, damn! Okay, gotta take the fannies down quick. Or else I'm just gonna get shot to pieces. Good to Force know! <laughs> yeah, I'm. Th this is this is my hole now. This is my home. Shoot you in the unmentionables. Get out of my way. Good throw. Reloading! Hold on, Edie! This bitch! Yeah. Oh, wow, I really wish it would stop doing that. Yeah, I'm a sniper too, bitch. You explode now. <laughs> Whee! I've got to admit, that's what I miss about playing the Adept, is just lifting people off and using throw to bat them off into the... Uh, off into the distance. So much fun playing an adept. I mean, the engineer is cool and all, but oh man, you, you can't beat playing the adept. It's just too much fun. Uh, 
I thought hospitals were ugly to fight through. This is so much worse. At least it's not trying to kill us this time. Yeah, don't speak too soon, eh? Frickin' more of them? Eat it, bitch. God damn. Yeah, not today, toots. Gotcha. Sniper wolf, you ain't. I don't think we need to reactivate the generator. We're going up the ladder anyway. This looks like a boss bat, uh, well, boss room, fight room. So much stuff to hide behind, too. Uh, why is the game giving me money? I'm pretty sure it's the end. Where am I going to have time to go shopping? Grayson's brain is a mess. He must have been completely under Reaper control by the end. And the physical enhancements? Extremely impressive, if we could avoid having entire neural pathways rewritten in the process. Grayson's failure was due to a lack of resolve. He wasn't loyal to anything but his next dose of red sand. You'd like to try it on loyal test subjects, sir? Find volunteers among our new recruits. The physical benefits are too useful to ignore. Jesus. The performance upgrades are off the charts. Our troops can outfight any Alliance soldier. Roll it out. I want all troopers fitted with implants before the Reapers arrive. I'm still concerned about us losing control of our forces. Some of them are already hearing voices. When our work at Sanctuary pays off, the only voice they'll be hearing is ours. Oh, God. Sir, you wanted my opinion on this. It's too dangerous. No, we're close. Sanctuary was a success. We can control Reaper forces. Everything we've been fighting for, every sacrifice we've made, it's about to pay off. We can't lose you, sir. Humanity needs your mind, and they need it intact. I understand the danger, Janna. That's why I'm trusting you with this. As long as you're here, I know you'll keep me in line. I'm holding you to that, sir. Okay. Begin the procedure. No anesthetic. Computer, end recording. Madman. Right. Oh, this looks like a final stairway. Well, ramp. This is it. Stay sharp, everyone. We need to locate the Prothean VI. Shepard, you're in my chair. This chair's about the only damn thing you have left. Cerberus is finished. On the contrary, we have achieved everything I ever imagined. Almost everything. Yeah. We all saw what you accomplished on Sanctuary. But it's not the same as controlling a Reaper. A significant hurdle. But thanks to the Prothean VI, I have what I need to make it a reality. The Catalyst. 
Yes. What is the catalyst? And how exactly will it help you control the Reapers? You'll have to ask the B.I. yourself. I'm done helping you. When did you start? You think because I'm willing to use the enemy's tactics that they're no longer my enemy? Everything, Shepard, everything I've done has uplifted humanity. Not only above other species in our galaxy, but over the Reapers. If you're willing to do everything it takes, then hand over the Catalyst. With the Crucible, we can end this. It's not that simple. It is. It's that simple. We're fighting each other while the Reapers occupy Earth. It's time to stop. Your idealism is... admirable, Shepard. But in the end, our goals are simply too disparate. I believe destroying the Reapers would be the worst mistake we could ever make. And nothing you can say will ever convince me otherwise. Even with Cerberus in ruins, you still think you can do this your way? I'd expect you to say that. You never truly believed in us. Cerberus isn't just an organization or the people behind it. Cerberus is an idea. That idea is not so easily destroyed. Besides, I've already acquired what you're looking for. Edie. I've almost got it. Edie, I'm surprised at you. Working so hard to bring about the Reaper's destruction. Don't listen to him. You could have destroyed Eva's body, but instead, you chose to control it. It was necessary. My point, exactly. I've got it. Online. Security breach detected. Enjoy your little chat, but don't overstay your welcome. You are attempting to recover me from indoctrinated forces? Yes. I need to know what the catalyst is. Security protocols have been overridden. I will comply. The catalyst enhances dark energy transmissions and coordinates the entire mass relay network. In your cycle, it is known as the Citadel. What? The catalyst is the Citadel. So the Crucible and Citadel together can stop the Reapers? That is correct. But the Citadel was built by the Reapers. The plans for the Crucible were passed down to us from the previous cycle, and countless cycles before that. At some point, it is difficult to pinpoint when. The Crucible plans were adapted to incorporate the use of the Catalyst. Presumably, the Crucible was not sufficiently powerful to defeat the Reapers. So we used their own technology against them? Precisely. Why couldn't you tell me this before? It was feared that if the Reapers were aware of the Catalyst's intended use, they would retake control of it. I am programmed to withhold that information until the Crucible is complete. It's as ready as it's gonna be. Let's get it to the Citadel. That may no longer be possible. Why not? The one who broke through my security protocols, the one you call the Elusive Man, has fled to the Citadel and informed the Reapers of our purposes. Damn it! Then the Citadel is in danger. The Reapers will take control of it. They already have. The Citadel has been moved to the Reaper-controlled space. Moved? To where? To the system you refer to as Sol. Earth. Correct. The Reaper forces will now consolidate power around the Catalyst and protect it at all costs. The odds of accessing it are remote. Don't count us out yet. We've come this far and we'll finish this. We'll get the Crucible to Earth. I hope you find success. Edie, get me hacked. He needs... Not so fast. Oh. You. He did warn you not to overstay your welcome. Whoa! Yeah, eat a dick, you piece of shit. This is better than Stetia. More personal. Affirmative. All you are doing is making humanity. Oh. You're using Reaper Tech.
That's a problem. Damn it. <sighs> Man, this boss fight needs a freaking break in the middle, I'm telling you. Oh, God. Uh. This is better than Thessia. More personal. Dang it. All you are doing is making humanity weak. You're using Reaper Tech. Don't shit talk the assassin, Shepard. You ran at Citadel. You ran on Thessia. Shut up! Maybe. Oh, go down. Oh, jeez. That was a bastard. are preparing to complete their harvest of your species. I'll stop them. It is too late. I recommend investigating immediately. I'll stop them. And we will. you've heard about the Citadel. Just now. Do we know what's going on? Why it's here? The Citadel is the catalyst. Thanks to the elusive man, the Reapers are now aware that we know. And so they moved it here to protect it? As far as I can tell. What does this mean for the Crucible? I'll talk to Hackett about that, but it looks like our plan is even more desperate now. Agreed. I've got a team in London. The Reapers have been preparing for something here. Now, we know what for. We'll scout it out. 
Try to find out as much as we can. Roger that. Well, at least we'll be seeing you sooner rather than later. Be careful, sir. You too, Shepard. Anderson out. Oh boy. Right. Priority Earth. And that will be the only mission left available to us now. Because after the Cerberus mission, that's pretty much where it leads us. There's no more side missions. Hey, it's an important door. Ready whenever you are, Commander. Specialist trainer. I'm all right, really. I'm as surprised about it as you are, but I'm all right. You're a credit to your uniform, Samantha. I had a very compelling example. Well, doesn't look like we've got any new messages. Nope. Let's go and check on Edie and Joker before heading to the other levels. You remember our first run to Eden Prime all those years ago? With that Tory inspector watching us? Nihilus. Yeah, I told you that mission was gonna be bigger than we thought. I think you can mark that prediction down as accurate. And now we're heading back to Earth. Is this mission gonna be bigger than we thought, too? Man, I hope not. A nice routine delivery run would be fine with me. It's been an honor, Commander. Same here, Joker. I don't know how it's gonna end, but whatever happens... What do you mean, whatever happens? Everyone knows what's gonna happen. You're gonna kick some Reaper ass, that's what you do. And I'll be flying you there in style. The Normandy is ready, Shepard. All systems are armed, all ammunition is loaded, all reloads have been manufactured. Thruster fuel is at maximum. Cyber warfare suites have evolved in ways that would be computationally impossible to predict. I have also kissed Joker for luck. Commander? How's your focus, Edie? Any big questions? No. Any small questions? No. Any lingering issues? About what? An imperfect designer who could be seen as a warped father figure, maybe? Definitely not. Did something prompt this line of questioning? I've just learned you have to ask about these things. The Normandy is ready, Shepard. There is new information Ooh. on the private messages terminal. New information on the private messages terminal. Email from Captain A. Reynolds to Miranda Lawson. The Alliance wishes to express its gratitude for your assistance with the information you've been sending us on Cerberus. We've been able to avoid ambushes they were setting up for our supply convoys. We'd offer you additional resources, but I understand you've procured a Class F private fighter and joined up with former colleagues. I also understand that several Cerberus bases were lost after being attacked by a reported group of private special operatives of no known affiliation. The Alliance cannot officially condone this kind of independent operation, nor do we actually confirm that these operations are taking place. Good luck, Ms. Lawson. <laughs> Doing good work. How are you holding up, Liara? Nervous. Frightened. Anxious to go. But glad I'm here. And I'm ready whenever you're ready, Shepard. In fact, I think I've checked my equipment three times. Seven times, Dr. Tassoni. Stop me if I try for eight. We can do this, Shepard. We can indeed. Let's see what Charquois has got to say. You've come a long way since those days under Captain Anderson. It has been my great honor to be with you through this journey. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Doctor. Goodbye, Shepard. And good luck. You've come a long way since oh, those days. Okay, it's going to be a repeat conversation. Get me out of here. I'm proud of you. Thank you, Doctor. Goodbye, Shepard. And good luck. Shepard, yeah. we were just saying goodbye. 
And making friendly wagers. Optimistic wagers, in your case. A Turian military operative competing with a Corian mechanic, and I'm the optimistic one. Do you remember Ilos? Yes. It was filled with geth, which tilted the odds in your favor. Excuses, excuses. I doubt you'll be hacking any synthetics this time. I still have the shotgun. No. I'll be sure to let a few Reaper forces get close enough for you to use it. Thanks. Of course, if they get past me, they'll be right on top of you. That's what the armor's for. <laughs> you two have been with me longer than most. You believed in me when nobody else did. Thanks. We'll finish this the way we started it. Together. Damn right. Kila Salai, Shepard. At least we finally killed Lieutenant Bastard Kai Lang. I just hope we get to do the same to his general. It's kind of amazing how everything's come full circle. The Citadel's been the center of galactic civilization, a Reaper trap, and my source of employment for a long time. And now it's our salvation for any chance at winning this war. I think it's time we got you back home, Shepard. Earth will either be remembered as the place we beat the Reapers, or it'll be a smoking ruin for the next cycle to wonder about. Oh, another boy. time, maybe. Kill us a lie, Shepard. Yes, indeed. I think we've got a few more people that we need to speak to on the ship. Let's go and do that and get that out of the way before the final mission can begin. Nobody in there. Nah. Hey, Shepard. That was rough. Glad everyone got out of there. Ready to head home? Home. Back to Earth. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm ready. About time. About freaking time. And if the Reapers mess with anything I left behind, I'm gonna be so pissed. See you topside, Shepard. Hey, Shepard. Well, that's what Caden's got to say about the whole thing. Uh, right. Garrison Tully, Stern, head to engineering. Okay, first of all, we got Diane. Whatever her name is. And she has nothing to say. Are you alright? Ah! Not a colony kid, Shepard. Beckenstein. It was right next door to the Citadel. Was? Was. I'm sorry. That'll be why. The Reapers didn't even... Oh. Okay. Uh. Are you alright? Nah. I'm a colony kid, Shepard. Beckenstein. It was right next door to the Citadel. Was? Was. I'm sorry. The Reapers didn't even land on it to harvest. Just took a few shots from space. You know, because the Reapers hit industrial centers. And we have factories that make binoculars. Had factories. We're gonna beat them. Yeah. Hell yeah, we are. Well, I have to say, that conversation seemed a strangely bit disjointed. Here he is, the man, the myth, the legend, the only Prothean left alive. I am prepared for whatever lies ahead, Commander. The Reapers have haunted the galaxy long enough. It is time to end the nightmare. The deaths of my soldiers will be avenged. The events of the Cronian Nebula will not have been in vain. The last Prothean awaits your command. There was no final battle against the Reapers in my cycle. A great moment lies before you, Commander. There was no final battle against the Reapers yep. in my cycle. A great moment lies before you, Commander. And it does. Good luck with the assault. Wish I was joining you. No, you don't. I've seen you shoot. Fine. Then I wish I could shoot better. Then I wish I was joining you. Take care, Shepard. You too, Donnelly. The Normandy is ready to go, Commander. Give the word and we'll get you to Earth. And Commander, it's been such an honor to be a part of the team. 
Likewise, Gabby. Good luck, and be careful, okay? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Commander, the Normandy is as ready as she'll ever be. That goes double for my team. We're prepared for whatever hits us. And Commander, whatever happens today, it has been an honor and privilege to serve with you. The honor's been mine, Adams. Give him hell, sir. Oh, we'll give him more than that. Okay. Shuttle bay. Cross-checking our parts inventory. Everything is in order. Everything is in order. Nothing to say about the final mission? Fair enough. What about you, James? Sticking it to that bastard Kai Ling must have felt good. It certainly did. Just wish we'd have caught up to the elusive man before he could screw us over again. You and me both. Well, at least we get to head back to Earth. I've been asking for it. I just hope I'm gonna make those Reapers pay. For everything they've done. Hey. Oh, and pay they will. In the blood of the many. Right, I'm pretty much sure shit I'm set as I'm ever going to be. And I have a new message at my private terminal. Normal is the best revenge. Commander, I don't know if you're aware how much you mean to people, but I am. The things I see in Battle Space's mailbox could make a geff grow tear ducts. Page after page of people asking you to go save their mother's planet, or the homeworld they outgrew, or the mining colony they sank their fortunes into. They don't know that you can't do it all. They just know Commander Shepard beat a reaper once and can do it again. I know how they feel. When I heard about Beckenstein, it was like all the nerves in my body were cut. But I need to believe that this isn't the end. I need to believe that you're going to destroy the Reapers and I'm going to film it as it happens. And when the fight is over and my signal goes out on tight beam, people are going to come together from all over the galaxy. They're going to watch from their couches and they'll celebrate. And one day they'll laugh again. The laugh part is important. I want you to make it all normal again, Shepard. Because that's the best revenge I can think of. Diana, P.S. If I end up making it out of this, but you don't, I'll make sure you get a hero's funeral at Beckenstein Wake. That's like an Irish wake, but not as sober, not as sober and reserved. <laughs> well, the next time you see me, folks, we will be beginning the final mission to save Earth and the entire galaxy from the Reaper threat. Until then. Take it easy. Bye bye. Hey, let me take a second to thank you for watching. If you like what you see, then give it a thumbs up. It really helps. Hit that subscribe button to keep up to date with release content and streams. Also, click that bell for those notifications. And please feel free to leave a comment. This is Vaguely Sane, signing off.